doing great. Today I wanted to do a simple design inspired by this. This is my candlelight holder, kind of an African style and I think it's really cool. And I was sitting, I have this in my nail room and I was sitting by my table and then I just saw the design and I thought that would be a cool nail design. So this is my interpretation of it onto my nails. Uh, I don't really know what to call this shape, but I call it surfboard shape. <laughs> if you know the real name, please comment down below so I'll know what it is. And I hope you like this design. Stay tuned and I will show you how to get these nails. Start off by applying a protective base coat. I'm using OPI Nail Envy. This is a matte one, but that's not important. What you just need is a base coat. And this is a nail strengthener. So we'll apply this. And next I'm gonna pick out the color that's gonna be the color, uh, the base color for me. And I'm gonna use this one from Essie. And this one has the name Bikini So Teeny. And I will apply two coats all, all over all of my nails with this one. So here is this gorgeous blue. I'm gonna pick out my black striper with a thin brush. And I'm gonna make three surfboard shapes. I don't know how to describe it better, but that's the way I realized it was. So it's going to be like this, but actually since I got a little smaller than I expected, I'm going to make them, maybe I'll make more. the rest of the nails as well. So now you're gonna need some paper and black nail polish on the paper, on a dot here. You can use any black nail polish that you have, but I'm using this one from Chinese, uh, OBI, which has the name Lady in Black. So I'm gonna pick out my dotting tool and I'm on a pretty decent sized dotting tool. So I'm gonna make dots in the center of these surf surfboards. And this is where I'm going to place the rhinestones. So make them pretty decent big. I want it to be a little bit bigger than the rhinestones because this is going to be like a small frame for the rhinestones. Like and I'll just take some clear polish, either if it's top coat or base coat or whatever you have, and place it onto the dots where you're going to apply the rhinestones. and then just place them in the center. Like that. So now just apply a top coat and to seal in your design and that is actually it. So I will be right back. But to show you first, I'm using Seshvit Dry Fast Top Thank Coat. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy these easy tribal nails inspired by my candlelight holder. And I hope you all have a wonderful summer and there will be more tutorials to come. I know I've been bad to do them frequently lately, but I've you know, been busy during summer and time off and all that. So I will get better again and I will see you soon again and take care. Bye-bye.